Morning Satsang with Paramahamsa Nityananda, a look at recent events from Nityananda Vedic Temple, Ohio, an update from Nityananda Dhyanapitam, Sri Lanka, including recent events from Navaratri. Nityananda Gurukul enters into its eighth year. Nityanandam and welcome to Nityananda TV News 2013. Now for today's top stories. Morning set saying with Paramahamsa Nityananda. In 27 countries around the world today, Sri Sri Sri, 1008, Acharya Mahamandaleshwar of Atal Pita, Atal Akada, Swami Sukhudevananji is here gracing us and Swamiji is the Acharya Mahamandaleshwar of Atal Akada and the senior most Mahatma among all the 13 Akadas so practically spiritually he guides all the 13 Akadas his decisions his guidance is the last word in all the 13 Akadas his words are the final words in all the 13 Akadas Swamiji is gracefully accepted to visit our ashram and he is here from yesterday. Yes, he is here to bless all of us. So, on behalf of me and on behalf of Nityananda Dhyanapitam and Nityananda Sangha, we welcome Swamiji with our humble respects. And if I have to introduce Swamiji to all of you, Sri 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 Swami Swami Shukdevananji Maharaj is the Acharya of the Atal Akada and senior most Mahatma in all the 13 Akadas. At the age of 12, Swamiji received Sanyas Diksha. At the age of 12, he received Sanyas initiation. All great Mahatmas who have contributed, achieved, all of them are Bala Sanyasis. All of them are Bala Sanyasis. Swamiji is also a Bala Sanyasi. From the age of 12, he is living Sanyas life. and the age of 12, he received Sanyas initiation. His Sanyas Guru was Swami Sadananda Puriji Maharaj of Gita Mandir in Aradwar. Swamiji is an adept in Sri Vidya Sampradaya and received his first initiation in Sri Vidya from Kanchi Shankaracharya Sri Chandrasegarendra Saraswati Swamiji from Kanchi Kamakoti Pita and later remaining had the remaining initiations from his Sri Vidya Guru Swami Vidyashramji Maharaj. Swamiji has a vast spiritual knowledge, I tell you. From yesterday, I am spending time with Swamiji. Earlier, I had the opportunity of having Swamiji's darshan and sambhashan in two Kumbha Melas in 2007 and 2013. Both the time, I have spent quite a good amount of time with him. But yesterday, from yesterday, when Swamiji is going around the ashram and blessing each department and guiding us. I had the fortune of having the glimpse of vast spiritual knowledge of Swamiji. And I can say, Swamiji is a moving university, he is a mobile university <laughs> on his own right. He is a living university, mobile university. I can tell you, he is the pride of Hinduism. Is the pride of Hinduism. A look at recent events from Nityananda Vedic Temple, Ohio. Brahma Murari Surachita Dingam Nirmala Bhai. 
ಪ್ರಶಿತ ಶೋಭಿತ ಲಿಂಗಂ ಜನ್ಮಜ ದುಃಖ ವಿನಾಶಕ ಲಿಂಗಂ ಜನ್ಮಜ ದುಃಖ ವಿನಾಶಕ ಲಿಂಗಂ ತತ್ ಪ್ರಣಮಿ ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಲಿಂಗಂ ತತ್ ಪ್ರಣಮಿ ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಲಿಂಗಂ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ ಮುರಾರಿ ಸುರಾರ್ಚಿತ ಲಿಂಗಂ ನಿರ್ಮಲ ಭಾಷಿತ ಶೋಭಿತ ಲಿಂಗಂ ಜನ್ಮಜ ದುಃಖ ವಿನಾಶಕ ಲಿಂಗಂ ತತ್ ಪ್ರಣಮಿ ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಲಿಂಗಂ from Nityananda Dhyana Pitham Sri Lanka including recent events from Navaratri
Nityananda Gurukul enters into their eighth year, Paramahamsa Nityananda announced recently, entering into the eighth year of the extraordinarily successful Nityananda Gurukul, students of the internationally recognized school receive all the education of regular schools with the addition of yoga, meditation, living ancient truths, art, dance, Sanskrit chanting and more. Some of the extraordinary achievements of just a small sampling of some of the previous Gurukul students include conducting a live weekly call-in show on India television, giving direct and personalized life solutions immediately to all callers, developing and presenting yoga, dance, music, and drama shows, as well as proficiencies in the ancient arts of yoga involving practice on a rope and pole, and teaching kids around the world on a weekly basis, spreading the science of Nityananda Gurukul, through the Internet's video conferencing, the intelligence and spontaneity of the students has been called terrifying by their high school teachers, and the student body continues to grow and expand into new areas of sharing and contributing to society in ways that continue to surprise parents and teachers. Congratulations to the staff and students of Nityananda Gurukul, and thank you to Swamiji for showing us the real possibility of each child expanding into their highest potential as we now see the results on their blissful faces. It says that the fragrance of the flower even enhances our intuitive brain. Flowers have a great capacity to heal and balance the emotional component of our brain. Temple. Temples form the core of our rich Vedic culture. Rituals, events, and celebrations in the temples are ingenious, innovative, and colorful expressions of the mind. 
Temples as part of our lives assist us learn the creative celebratory lifestyle while helping us connect to higher realities. Temple activities can be rephrased as ecstasy in the rich lifestyle.